for the senior divisional officer from Gokutunja division. If you have the uh, or the ancestral backing as such, why don't you allow your fight uh, to be fought by your ancestors? Why challenge the decision in, in court? Well, that is a very good question. But with the ancestor, why did they put me here? They put me here to be their face on the face of the earth because they are actually there fighting. Guess what? They are actually fighting. And they were not fighting. The only reason they know my two faces was that they said I am a sponsor of the Ambazonia or the separatists. Which is a lie. They fabricated story, fake papers, and everything. And I challenged the government to go and take and look some background from where I've ever been. I've never been part of the group that I'm attaching me to it. And that is how, it, uh, uh, how the Paramount World Live worked with some areas and fabricated strange stuff, fabricated fake stuff, and carried it to them. If they wanted to go by the tradition, there's no way they can transfer my my my, my chip density, or they can transfer the work and chip density because it is there and it's always going to be there. And now that they say they are not, how then the question? Why did they lose when the work and chip density was in place for one year? And then now that the work and chip density has been transferred for how many months? What have they gained? What? Nothing. And they can they survive without motor? No, they cannot. And then again, when you go to Mortan Palace Museum of Babylon uh, Heritage, Mortan Palace Museum of Babylon Heritage, you will see all these things I'm saying. And you go even into the Paramount River's own museum, the Babylon Royal Museum, you will see all these things. So in Babylon, they have these solid two museums that is showing everything and it's well planted. Of course, our have originality because it has the royal chamber that is there we call the juicer he has the sign of the mangoes the sign of the mother the sign of the, the chief that brought him there and uh, it has uh many other things that it, it doesn't exist elsewhere in Buffalo. it's just there in the and it has to be of course i am living the fight to my ancestors but I have to be their human face to let the government know because the ancestors cannot come and do the federal work. So that's what I'm doing. And that's why if you see anybody fighting, anybody going to hit anybody, anybody going to knock down anybody. Right now, that everybody can tell you that I am the one who has been struggling to get the students back to school. That's why we're having the, the uh, Royal College of High Science and the UAB. They were operational on the 6th of June. But those children have not gone to school for the past three years, this is a four year coming. But this one, nobody is saying anything, nobody care about it. I'm the one. And then, not only that, the PBI, who is me, is the person who's supposed to make sure that the kingdom stay intact. That's why I suffer the most from the Amber. The Ambazonian fight, the, the Amber boys, they have destroyed, have lost more than 15 million. If you can check, you will see it. But no other person has lost anything. The Palmer will have not lost anything. And the third in command, which is the chief point, no not everything. Why? Because I am doing my job like the chief of Mortar and the, the second ruler of Babugo, that the tradition said I must make sure Babugo stay intact, Babugo stay united, Babugo stay in peace. So that's why I'm the target. Your Highness, is there no other is there no other peaceful means that you can resolve this conflict rather than going to court? Don't you think yeah, some of your subjects may start fighting because both of you are not in our court? Of course, what you say is very true because everything is dialogue. Even when they fight wars upon wars, they will end up by dialoguing. Uh, if you take, for instance, uh, the United States have been fighting in Afghanistan for 20 years. Now they're still dialoguing now to go back to peace. How many people are dead? So that is what I stand for, peace, dialogue. And I have written to everybody I should be able to write to. So today, nobody has re replied to me. Even the team in China auditor, who is supposed to call me order if I was going wrong, he has never done that. So today, he has never done that. Um, 
So, for me, I just believe that the only way that I can be able to get her and get justice is to go to the Ministry Court. Because in the amendment document, he said, it is either illegal or an error. So I asked him, where is the illegality? He said, he did not reply to me. Where is the error? He did not reply to me. I want to fix the error. He did not reply to me. I want to fix the illegality. He did not reply to me. I now contacted the NGO that did the document and said, but I know you are a seasonal, uh, 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 administrator of the highest rank, and now you are even going to go and tell what was wrong? Was there something that I would really do? He said everything was done in the right way. That he himself is shocked because he do not know what was wrong. Then he's still going to, 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 to know you know what is the error or what is the illegality. So to me, I believe that we have to talk, we have to dialogue. And if there's anything to be fixed, they have to be fixed. Right now, the key of our was supposed to be the first, the Paramount ruler. He's supposed to be first class, but he's stuck on second class. And the only reason I applied for third class was because he got stuck on second class. And then now, he has to be on a different level while I'm on a different level. So he and I have to be one step lower than him. So if he's stuck on second class, I have to apply for third class, and that's what I did. Guess what? I'm now sitting on the throne of our senior brother, the third in command. To Thailand to fund it. And then the uh, Panaman ruler to know a city of my so he needs to move to his throne, which is to his position, which is first class, and then move to second class, and his uh major to fund it, come to where I am right now. Uh, uh, how does he do this? Are you aware that the Secretary General of the Presidency of the Republic, Ferdinand Gongo, has instructed uh, the Minister of Territorial Administration and other local administrative authorities to update him with the list of uh, chiefs in Cameroon, as well as suspend the creation of third class chiefdoms across uh, the country? Wait, that's good. I saw it. Which is right, but mine is not the creation of you. I was enthroned since the October 12th of 2001. So, my is not the question. Number two, my has already been recognized. Even if you were very depressed, you have been afraid for a year. You cannot be a chief for a year, and after a year, you are no more a chief. We know in the Northwest region that when once a chief, when enthroned, you are enthroned forever. You cannot be a temporary chief. That is why I kept telling people that. His uh, uh, royal uh, highness, uh, his royal majesty, our our son of form, king of king, his, uh, his majesty, uh, President Pia, is winning because we met him, our son of form, our king of king in language. And the noble tradition said, once met, he has to reign until the only time you will stop him from reigning is taking away from this world. Unless you want to kill President Bia, if you want to say he's not going to be our kid or kid and fall apart anymore. Do the same thing. You can only kill me because I'm already a chief. I can never not be a chief anymore. I said, someone cannot be a chief for one year and the other year is not be a chief. No, it can never ever happen. That's the thing in Norway. So, let's go back to the rules and the real concept. Okay. I was recognized by the government and all the total work done. They just need to go back now. And they uh, have reinstated it because nothing was, was done wrong. I didn't do anything wrong. They have reason from what I finally found out was that they said, I'm a sponsor to the Ambazonian. I'm an Ambar supporter. I'm an Ambazonian and all of that. Or I'm a separatist. I'm trying to divide Cameroon, which is not true. Everybody knows you can ask the ambassador here, uh, uh, His Excellency Tony. He will tell you that if there's one Cameroonian, one who stands for Individual one individual Cameroonian, Cameroon is me, and who is always everywhere with the government, with the people, with everything, night and day. I have worked tirelessly for all the years I've been in this country for my country, Cameroon, not expecting an appointment, not expecting a position, not expecting a job, just doing my job like a real good Cameroonian. I want to see Cameroon happy. Me, the most beautiful place on earth. It's our lovely people Cameroon. That's why all my investment is in Cameroon. 
Every dollar has not worked in the United States goes to Cameroon. Every dollar. And if you go there, you will realize that I've invested almost on everything. I have a rally, which is going. I have the Aurora Farm, the Aurora Ram, I have a, a rice field, fish pond, uh, now building a school, a market, water fishing. Oh, every single dollar I have, even with my, with my, with my queen and my children, it goes to Cameroon because we love Cameroon. We know that's where we have to be. And we must make sure it's within our own power to help the peace and unity of Cameroon for forever. Your yeah, Highness, you know, uh, like me, that uh, funds from the Northwest region command a lot of respect amongst these subjects. My question to you is how much respect do you command amongst your subjects? I'm very happy you asked me the question. Of course, I even command more respect than any other traditional ruler in the whole uh, Northwest. I can say the whole Northwest. Uh, let me take, take you, uh, give you one example. Uh, every, everybody that knows me, he addresses me the way to make that dress me. Give me my way of everything. When Kutunga was shut down for months, no movement, nothing, every other person tried and failed. When I took on the responsibility, I talked to the mayor of the uh, the same time, he agreed, he said, try. And I took up the responsibility. Guess what? I finally solved the problem, and Dr. Kutunga was open. It could have been open earlier than that, but the same the uh, mayor said, everybody has to pay their taxes before they open the shop. And these people did not have money to pay because they have not been selling for months. So what did I do? I went to the deal, uh, to the mayor and said, how much do they owe for taxes? He told me, two point something million. I sent the money to them by, by wire transfer and to the uh, uh, council account, council treasury, which can be verified. So when the council received it and their taxes were paid, this was not a loan to these people. I just wanted my community, my mother to be happy and they opened the way because when the food was blocked, even the green wood and neighboring villages and all that, it was affected. It was affected. So I paid this money out of my pocket and everything was open. It can be verified. We go to the council, you see there, and I pay people something million to open shape for to pay taxes for uh, 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 people who don't have the money for the selling and which, which means you are a very you are a very rich form or traditional ruler. Well, well, not really, but I was doing that for my people and I told this to say that. I am highly respected because if not, everybody was turned down. But when I came to beg, I beg left, I beg right, I beg the elbow, I beg the 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 amount of riches uh, funds uh, have in the Northwest region is equivalent or synonymous to the number of wives and children. How many wives do you have and the number of children? If that, <laughs> if you would permit to ask <laughs> that. that <laughs> <it's time>. <laughs> <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you for asking me this. Normally, in my tradition, in the Papua uh tradition and culture, you do not the number of wives you have, the chief or the king do not disclose the number of wives you have because when one chief, one traditional ruler disappeared, the other one came and said, All the wives of the first traditional ruler except his mother and they marry his and aunt. So even I have some queens in my palace who have been married to four different, four different chiefs of mother and they are my queen. There's no difference between them and those that are married. So there are so many of them. And uh, as a matter of fact, they in the United States like, oh no, you can't do polygamy. I say, no, I'm not. I'm in the United States for what? I'm just like, you can be the United Nations or uh, a group of people go somewhere to work. And this is not my country. I'm just here working and I'm going back to my country. And as we speak, it's not the United States government who knows for sure how many uh, I have multiple wives and more and uncounted children, if they come to me now, oh, we don't want what you're doing, you go back to your country. I say, oh, thank you. 
I will be the place to go back to my country tomorrow because I cannot deal with my tradition or my culture, especially the number of children. They always say that in the, in the, in the, in the tribe or in the, in, the, in, the, in the song, when the children of this person line up, the children of the paramount that with the king have to have the longest line, and the next longer line has to be made. She buys on the first, and the third longest line has to be four hundred. His Majesty four hundred. So you, whoever has the longest line, has the lo has the more power, has more dignity, and has more money. It's considered like war. So of course, I have the second longest line in of of children. And okay, yeah, yeah, we are Absolutely. gradually we are gradually moving out of time. So what is the way forward now for peace to reign in our beautiful okay. Babungo village in Gokutunja division? Thank so you after very all, much. you really said there must be peace. Yes, please. The only way for peace to reign now is for the paramount ruler and the elite to sit down and write to the administration and tell them that they made a mistake that they will deceive. Of course, they will deceive that I'm Amber. I'm not Amber. They see that I take bullets for Amber. I suffer losses for Amber. And write back to the head, to the senior division officer to retake my papers and also make the papers to our first in command, which is our senior brother, Daniel. Then also do the papers for our paramount ruler to be first class. Then I'll be second class. Then one day be third class. This is the way forward for peace. And if this is done today that we are speaking, everything will come back normal. If this is not done, this is what's going to happen. No matter what we do, we are wasting our time. I cannot force it. You cannot force it. Nobody can force it. Because it's been done, they come by the ground, by the ancestors, by the tradition. I cannot change the tradition. Nobody can change it. So the way forward right now is for everyone to come and recognize the Paramarula as the first class. Recognize me, Chief Bajo, be at the third and the second class, and recognize our brother, who is the third ruler of this kingdom, his uh, majesty, Kwanjo, as the third class, and let the edge of Google papers like that, because it is clearly stated in the secretary's uh, uh, document that in case there were any openings, there were any, they can go ahead and, uh, 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 and do it. In case there were anything, in case there were any anything that was not done, they can go ahead and do it. So right now, you just need to inform the government that something was done wrong. And the thing that was done wrong is rely on me. No, no, that rely on me. And uh, this is the consequences. Right now, they are stating it, and Babungo will become the ruler because we Babungo we rule the entire northwest. We Babungo we rule the entire northwest. How we gave land to Hamilton, and when they were not having children, we didn't have to give their daughter so they, they can okay. have children. Okay. not have children. We gave land to Bangola, Bambalam, Bamunka, Bambese, Baba. All of them, we gave land to them. We nurtured some of them. You come to Bangola, we show you that this is Mole which is Bangola. This is Babisi area. That area, those quarters I think called the Mole Eaton, the sea, the return. Uh, 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 all the people that we call uh, yeah, because we know these people and then gave the land to go and be where they are. They cannot come now and say we are doubting that we are. Okay. Marvelous. Thank you so much, uh, Your Highness, for taking time out of your busy schedule to talk to my media prime television. It was a pleasure having you on the program. I thank you very much and I really appreciate 